Our top story today comes from the South China Sea, where a potential crisis has been averted thanks to the successful negotiations of global leaders. After extended talks that have lasted for several weeks, the foreign ministers from the involved nations announced a peaceful resolution to the territorial disputes that have been causing tension in the region for years. The main points of the agreement include a mutual commitment to respect international law, a pledge to resolve future disputes through dialogue rather than military confrontation, and a promise to cooperate on environmental protection and sustainable fishing practices. This is a significant step towards stability in a region that has long been a hotspot for geopolitical tensions. Next, we move to Africa, where a groundbreaking renewable energy project has been announced in Kenya. The Kenyan government, in partnership with several international organizations, will build the largest solar farm in East Africa. Scheduled to be completed by the end of 2026, this project is expected to provide clean and affordable energy to millions of Kenyans, reducing the country's reliance on fossil fuels and contributing significantly to its efforts to combat climate change. In the Middle East, the peace process between Israel and Palestine has taken a positive turn, thanks to the tireless efforts of mediators from the United Nations. Both sides have agreed to return to the negotiating table after a hiatus of several years, raising hopes for a peaceful resolution to a conflict that has lasted for more than seven decades. The main points of the agreement include mutual recognition, the cessation of hostilities, and a commitment to a two-state solution. Finally, we turn to Europe, where the European Union has announced a major initiative to boost its cybersecurity capabilities. In response to recent cyber attacks that have targeted key infrastructures in several member states, the EU will invest heavily in advanced technologies and human resources to strengthen its defenses against cyber threats. The main points of the initiative include the establishment of a European Cyber Security Agency, increased funding for research and development, and a commitment to cooperate with international partners to combat cybercrime. And that's the World News for Friday, April 12, 2024. Stay informed, stay safe, and have a great day.